So in this particular video, uh, Charlotte's knee is being looked at by health professionals and this was uh, a few days after she got injured during her match with Asuka. Flair is out for about 9 months as uh, fans are already aware at this point and will miss major WWE PLEs such as Wrestlemania and uh, Bash in the Berlin, SummerSlam, Backlash. And now the recovery period starts. Flair immediately kicked off uh, her uh, recovery training and uh, began posting videos on social media on her TikTok and her Instagram handle. Here's Flair at the gym. Just a few days, I guess few weeks after uh, uh, her knee got injured. And she is feeling pretty okay here. And here's uh, the queen lifting some weights. Working on her biceps. And here's another video of Charlotte Flair at the gym. Working on her legs. One of the best quads in the business. Charlotte Flair possesses. Here's Flair. Just look at those quads. Absolutely incredible. There, there, are not, there are not many superstars who put uh, this much effort into their physique as Charlotte Flair does. And it shows when she, whenever she is on WWE TV. Just incredible stuff from the Queen here. Here's another video. Uh, I need a tan. The caption states, I need a tan. And at this point, Flair's... Uh, knee looks pretty good and it won't be a surprise 10 weeks tomorrow it says it won't be a surprise if uh, she ends up returning way before her uh, actual return date her uh, estimated return date just look at how she is working out and it doesn't seem at all that her knee is injured at this point charlotte flair was in immense pain when her knee was injured during her match with Asuka. And this video was taken a few weeks after that. She can jump pretty, uh, she can jump properly in this video. And it seems like she is healing really well. Judging by the kind of jumps she is taking in this particular video. Flair seems to have a full-fledged gym at her home. Where she regularly works out. Here she is working on her legs, on her quads. And the weight, the weights that she has put on that barbell seem quite huge, seem quite massive. It remains to be seen how many WWE PLEs she will miss. But her fans have been, are patiently waiting for her to make a big return to WWE TV. So yeah. At this point, fans are aware that Charlotte Flair got injured during her match uh, with Asuka, a singles match on an episode of SmackDown during uh, uh, late 2023. And uh, Flair was in huge pain back then. Uh, she had injured her knee, one of her knees, and uh, immediately went into recovery. And WWE later announced that she was going to be out for about 9 months, which meant that she was going to miss WrestleMania, Elimination Chamber that she had already missed, then Bash at Berlin, Backlash, SummerSlam and many other major WWE pay-per-views, PLEs. Uh, he is hoping that Charlotte Flair, judging by these videos, Charlotte Flair is making a really really good recovery, quick recovery and it won't be a surprise as I previously mentioned if Charlotte Flair ends up returning before her due date. So he is hoping Charlotte Flair makes a quick recovery and returns to WWE TV before the estimated date of her return.